Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can use this 8205S N channel MOSFET IC. Now, as you might already know, MOSFET generally comes into this package, which is TO220AB, which is preferred for commercial industrial applications. This IRFZ44N is a great MOSFET for fast switching of XYZ stuff. But if you want a MOSFET switch which is small, for example, you want to make a PCM circuit for lithium ion cell, but the PCB size for this project would be smaller than the MOSFET itself. In that case, you could use a small package MOSFET, but what if you need two MOSFETs in that circuit? The PCB itself is small and how you gonna put another MOSFET on it? In this case, you could use a MOSFET IC which have more than one internal MOSFET inside. For example, this 8205S MOSFET IC. It's available in SOT23-6 package and it's pretty small. But where you can buy these MOSFETs from? You can buy these MOSFETs from utsource.net. Link is in video description. These MOSFET are particularly suited for low voltage applications and low inline power losses are needed in very small outline surface package mount. Now the great thing about this MOSFET is this. Yes, it have two MOSFETs in a single package. This means that this IC have two gates for each different internal MOSFETs and two sources. The drain of both MOSFETs are common. Now, an average MOSFET pinout is this, the gate, source and drain. But the pinout for this MOSFET is source 1, drain, source 2, gate 1, drain and gate 2. If you want to know more about these MOSFETs, check out this video of ours. Here's the schematic of this MOSFET. These are the electrical parameters of this MOSFET. Its drain to source voltage is 20 volt. The gate source voltage is 8 volt. And the continuous drain current is 5 ampere. Read its data sheet for more info. Here's a practical example. I will use this 8205S MOSFET to switch a 12 volt DC motor. I basically followed this schematic and this was the setup. By supplying voltage to the gate of MOSFET, the motor turns on and off. The same arrangement is for the other MOSFET configuration which can be triggered with the gate 2. As you can see this small IC is driving a 12 volt DC motor without any issues. By using this MOSFET IC you can drive or switch lot of stuff which makes this IC ideal for many embedded application. Well I hope this video was helpful to you guys. If yes then do not forget to hit the subscribe button. Check out our UT source website for buying electronic stuff and I'll see you guys next time.